Hello, welcome back. Today I would like to show you how you can jailbreak your iPhone, iPod, or iPad running on iOS 12.4.7. For this one, we are going to use Rootless Jailbreak 4. And for Rootless Jailbreak 4, it does support from iOS 12 to 12.4.8. And 12.4.8 has just been released by Apple and it does support on this Jailbreak 2. So, and you can see on my iPad. I have iOS 12.4.7 so we can jailbreak using rootless but now you're gonna go to Wi-Fi first so to install rootless jailbreak you need to configure on Wi-Fi so now we're gonna go to this eye icon here and then you're gonna find configure proxy click on this one and you're gonna see it is stay off but now we're gonna click on automatic and then you need to add URL so you need to tie as I tie here or you can copy from uh, my video description. Now you're gonna see something like this and then click on sale. And make sure you turn off and turn on your Wi-Fi again. And to make sure we can just go back to confirm. And you can see it is already checked. And now you need to go to Safari. Click on Safari right here and then you're gonna find clear history and website data. Click on clear history and website data. Click on clear one more time. And now it is the time to install rootless jailbreak 4. So we can just go back to Safari. Now we can go to Safari and you need to paste the link. So I'm gonna paste it. You're gonna scroll all the way down and you're gonna find rootless jailbreak 4 or C2.0 and you can see it say 12.0 to 12.4.7 but don't worry about it if you have 12.4.8 it's gonna support because it used the same exploit so don't worry about it so click on this one now hit on install and we're gonna wait for the installation process you can see now it is installing on my device so all we have to do just wait patiently I'm gonna speed it up so you don't have to wait for it to finish now rootless jailbreak 4 has been installed on my device but you cannot open it for the first time you need to trust in settings so you're gonna go back to settings and then you're gonna go to general click on profile and device management here and then you're gonna trust the profile first and now we can launch rootless jailbreak but you need to remember that rootless jailbreak 4 only have 5% of success rate and if you jailbreak it for the first time you're gonna fail and you're gonna fail many times so you need to try as much as possible until you can jailbreak your device because it only has 5% of success rate so we need to try now I'm gonna try it right now so we can click on jailbreak Finally, I can get this to work and honestly for me I have tried more than 30 times I think it about 30 times and now I can get it to work and you can see we have fields and reprovision and you're gonna notice there is no side here but you can install Siley so we're gonna go back to Safari then you can paste the link here and for the link you can find from my video description and now we can just click to go and then you're gonna see the pop-up like that click on open and then it will prompt and ask you to install Siley so click on install Siley and we can go back to the home screen now you can see Siley in, is installed on my iPad now Siley has been installed so we can just um, open it but first you need to trust so we're gonna go back to settings and then go to general scroll down and click on um, device management so you're gonna find the profile here 
and then we're gonna trust trust it one more time and now we can just go back to Siley and you can see Siley is fully working and it doesn't optimize for the iPad but don't worry about it you can just open it and you can just click on this one to uh, bring it to full screen finally thanks for watching and as I mentioned you need to help person to try to to jailbreak iOS 12.4.7 as we have only 5% success rate 